Your hands have made me and fashioned me. Give me understanding that I may learn your commandments. Psalms 119 verse 73 Through the Lord's mercies we are not consumed because his compassions fail not. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. The Lord is my portion, says my soul. Therefore I hope in him. Lamentations 3, verses 22 through 24. Just as David also describes the blessedness of the man to whom God imputes righteousness apart from works. Blessed are those whose lawless deeds are forgiven and whose sins are covered. Blessed is the man to whom the Lord shall not impute sin. Romans 4 verses 6 through 7. If my people who are called by my name will humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways then I'll hear from heaven and will forgive their sin and heal their land second chronicles 7 verse 14 knowing this verse that no prophecy of scripture is of any private interpretation for prophecy never came by the will of man but holy men of God spoke as they were moved by the Holy Spirit 2nd Peter 1 verses 20 through 21 be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid nor dismayed before the king of Assyria, nor before all the multitude that is with him. For there are more with us than with him. With him is an arm of flesh, but with us is the Lord our God to help us and to fight our battles. And the people were strengthened by the words of Hezekiah, King of Judah, Second Chronicles 32 verses 7 through 8. I will call upon the Lord who is worthy to be praised. So shall I be saved from my enemies. Psalm 18 verse 3.